welcome 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 guys welcome again here i am again with another little surprise today in this video i'm going to review first i'm gonna you know every time i review a card at the end i pull three cards we read the message and then i do a sound healing either a core cut or a chakra balance if it's necessary so stay to the end but i'm going to review these cards the secret power reading cards these are beautiful 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 i fell in love with them and i know some of you guys don't even know about it some of you already have some of this one but for those who don't know uh here it is so i'm going to review it don't forget, after I review it, I pull three cards, bring you a message, and depending on the message, we give you also a healing, either a core cut or a sound healing or a chakra balance. Depends on what it's, the cards tell us. I haven't pulled them yet. Also, if you're liking this, if you like my channel, if you like what I come up with, go ahead, subscribe, ring that little bell, that way you never, never, never have to miss any of my surprises. I'm always surprising. I just, you know what? I appear with other things. Again, I don't just only read cards. Again, if you like a private reading, absolutely. You can book me too. You can look at the link. You can book me and you have your private reading and it's fun. It's fun. I love doing this. Uh, if you need an aura cleansing, an aura cleansing and protection, I do that too. If you do I need a DNA activation, I do that too. Or if you want to learn how to be the magical you, I do have an amazing class. It's called Divine Magic. Also the link down there, take a peek, go read about it. And boy, I love that class. I do a live class every Thursday and I love my students and I love the, the group is amazing. You don't want to miss this group. You honestly, you don't want to miss this. This is something, a journey. It's a journey. It's not just a class. It's a journey where you will improve your life. You'll become a better you. That's for sure. Your life will improve. Everything will change in your life to better. To better. I, I, I know it. I know it. I've been through that journey myself. So I bring that to you guys. But I do a lot of things. I do a lot of things. Go ahead. Read, read my comments down there. Go check me out. But also do a comment write a comment to me tell me what would you like me to do more do you like the videos that i do do you like what i pull cards that when i do a review pull the card do the healing do you want more healings do you want more meditations do you just want the card reads only do you want transmission because i do have also a galactic transmission blessing go ahead at the videos somewhere in my youtube i believe if you go and the first thing on my youtube is right the first one so take advantage of that that will Will so so elevate your frequency again I'm about frequency I'm about going right into the source of what's stopping us from manifesting our life our dream life so I go directly into your subconscious everything I do the the the, the transformations the transmissions the sound healing everything I do I go directly to your subconscious so we can get rid of those negative things that we have accumulated all those uh, mental blocks that says that we're not allowed to do certain things and bring in the positive thing that they, they bring in the I can do it and yes it's possible and you actually get to do it so guys again don't forget to subscribe press the little bell and continue watching continue watching I will show you the cards and don't forget at the end of the showing all your cards i'm going to pull three cards and depending on the cards maybe we have a cord cut maybe we have a chakra balance maybe we have a sound healing whatever it calls for us to do love you guys see you continue enjoying Mwah. namaste namaste Ooh, let me bring you a little doo -doo 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 -doo. i'm always full of surprises <laughs> so this is a very nice cover beautiful very steady and it is from of course Rockapool <laughs> the, I like their work they always do pretty good job with it and when you open it gives you a little click here 
which is very easy to open. It comes with a nice little book, a beautiful, nice size book, and colors, colors, look at that, colors, colors, colors. I like that. And so it's a nice size. It's a nice size pocketbook and explains each of your cards. And then the cards are inside here. There's a little room in there. And the cards, this is how they look from the back. They are not, they don't stick to each other. They're pretty good, let's see, good quality. So I'm very, very, actually I'm very happy with these cards. Very, very happy with how beautiful they are. They're gorgeous. So let's do the flip through of all of them right now. So let's do the flip of it. Um, guys, they're not in order because I've been using it already. And they don't have a number. I don't see a number on them, but that's okay. And uh, the important here is to see how the cards look. And this one is the truth. Look at that. Very beautiful cards. They don't have borders. So that is very nice and the writing is very nicely implemented in there so it, it doesn't really stick out so you can actually enjoy the art and you know read on the on the cards read them well right like you know use your imagination use your intuition and whatever you know symbols you know like it has a mask in there you know how we all use you know a lot of us you know, use a mask, use a, a different face, and we don't like to show our truth self. And it's so important for us to do so because you are perfect the way you are, the true authentic you. But most of us, we're also afraid of, you know, of doing, of being ourselves. So we put a little mask there so everybody will like us. But anyways, let, I, this is about flipping the, the card. That one there, for some reason, it wanted me to talk more about it. So you know what? I go with what Divine asked me to do. And maybe some of you needed to hear this, to be your truth. You, as you are beautiful, God created you in perfection. So let's go to the next card. Here we go. Intimacy. Look at how beautiful that is. So I'm trying not to get the glare too much because they are a little bit shiny. Intimacy, and then we have Illusion. That's the Illusion card. Then we have Freedom. I like the horses, look at that. That's gorgeous. Freedom. And these are Oracle cards, they're not tarot. So it doesn't matter what order they are. Anyways, we're gonna use them exploration and there's a see the spaceship right there exploration and this one here is energy balance Ooh, that's nice just by looking at it i felt my chakras already balanced <laughs> this one here is divine consciousness look at that that is gorgeous I love everyone, every single card in here. There's not one that I don't like. Divas. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. I love them all. You know, that this is beautiful, this deck. And then we have community. I'm not going to blot too much. I know I'm bubbling. I want you guys to enjoy the cards. Communication. Change. You don't even need, you can't even, you know, you don't even need that. You can just so see that the difference, the change is trying to change. Boundaries. Animal Kingdom. Oh, this is gorgeous. I love animals. And this one has different animals all over the place. Animal Kingdom. Well, yeah, look at that. 
you know so it depends on what kind of read you're doing um, and you know it could be telling you to start connecting to your spiritual animal to see your animal within you or if you are seeing animals what animal are you looking at um, it's this could read different ways depends on the read that you're doing angel assistance wow I love it so nice reflection rainbow dragon I love this one I love you guys know me I'm into rainbows and all that of course I'm gonna love this one here <laughs> it's one of my favorites it's, it's it's a dragon but it's got unicorn energy too uh, this is a happy dragon it's a joyful dragon it's a, a, a good good dragon <laughs> I really love that one there it's one of my favorites gorgeous purification water oh my god <laughs> well you can tell I'm in love with this deck you know every every time you know I see them already but every time I see them I wow every time I see them <laughs> protection oh my god oh my god it's funny I gotta show this I was doing a read today with different cards but he appeared he was right in front of me wow <laughs> okay continue on I'm just freaking out <laughs> self-love look at that self-love I gotta put that one on the side Love. Then we have compassion. I love the colors. So nice. Then we have source. And then we have personal power. Animals. Oh goodness. Look at that. Medicine. Look at that. Gorgeous. So nice. We have lightning. Just beautiful. Then we have unconditional love. Look at that. How beautiful, guys. Honestly. I hope you're enjoying this. <laughs> Then we have Soul Journey. I have been wanting this one for a long time, but every time I try to get them, they're sold out. I finally got my hands on this. So, of course, I am so happy I did. And then Manifestation. Marilyn, look at that. He, I love Marilyn. He is amazing. And, and look at the power on this. Oh, boy. Affirmation, affirmation. Then we have Tree of Life. That is so cool. Tree of Life. Then we have Abundance. Abundance. Then we have sacred wisdom and it's uh the card that they use in the front look all the moons and it's an owl because the owl is very wise very wisdom and so it's sacred wisdom and you see that stick in the front cover right there because of the sacred power but in this one it's sacred wisdom very beautiful retreat boy do we all need to go and go out and a retreat once in a while and you know get yourself back into one piece rest ah. <laughs> after i say that yeah we need, all need to rest too very important look at the dolphins oh that is such a nice card the intuition wow. this one is gorgeous guys there's a little sacred geometry in this card. 
and I'm very much into that stuff too. I work with sacred geometry. I have a class that is called sacred geometry and my magical class is gonna get it too, but it more intense actually. Sounds, oh duh, that is exactly, I work with sounds to elevate frequencies, as you guys see, let, let's, let, let's do <laughs> As you can see, I have the sounds, we'll do something at the end of the reads. After this, I'm gonna read three cards, we're gonna pick three cards for you guys. And then we'll balance you. We'll do a, a chakra balance, okay? And so stay tuned until the end because this is from the beginning until the end. It's a win-win. Uh, and I like to do that. And let me know if you like that. Here comes the last card. Last card. Oh, transformation. Look at that. And it's the... Look at that. Transformation. So guys, if you're liking this so far, don't forget to subscribe. I'm press the little bell so you never miss my my shows and if you like to comment let me know if you like what I do because every time I bring a car review I will pull three cards bring you a message and do a healing or a balance or a core cut whatever it calls for at the end here I got more of like a chakra um a chakra balancing so we're going to do that after the card read so like that we implement the message of the cards into that healing so if you like this comment away or tell me also what else would you like me to do if you like something else would you like me to add something else to this video again this is all for you so let me know let's continue on now let's see how this shuffles okay guys let's do it so let's shovel them. They're big cards, so as you can see how big they are. Very easy to me, I, I because I don't use the poker, to me I can shovel them pretty easy. This light, nice and easy. So I have no problem with that. Now if you like doing the poker thing, I don't know how that, because I never tried that myself. I This is the way I shovel them. And then when I pick, what I do, I. I fan them like this and then I grab from whatever and so let's pick card number one here two and three there we go okay there we go so here we go I pull three cards so it's now you know you know how that goes right the messages together will be a messages for everybody but pick card number one pick card number two or number three the card that you pick is the one that you need to know more uh, it's kind of like emphasize of what is what you need to do more but at the end the whole message means one thing okay guys card number one two or three so let's see, car number one. Car number one. Here we go, Marilyn. Mm, nice car. Look how beautiful that car is. And this one says manifestation. See, it's perfect timing that this car came out because now is the time we get to manifest, guys. This is the time we get to manifest. And um, the way the planets are aligned, actually right now it's in our favor so whatever it is that you want to manifest you got that magic you got that power know that you can do that and the planets are aligned so it's in our favor so what is what you're going to manifest so don't don't think that um you know that you can just not even think about it it's good when you think about what is what you want to manifest because you put that power into it so put the intention of what is what you want and then you bring it into your life that's car number one car number two let's bring that car number two car number two affirmations this is the time where we do meditations and of course we're going to concentrate in doing positive affirmations if we want to manifest 
we definitely need to change our mindset. We need to clear all those blocks, all those uh, negative thoughts that we have, clear it out. And how do we do that? By doing affirmations, positive affirmations. And if you do it every day, you train and it goes right into your subconscious, right into your being. If you every day you practice, you practice, you practice positive affirmations, you're going to be vibrating that. So when you start vibrating and elevating your frequency is when you your manifestation will work. And so let's see what car number three is. Car number three, abundance. There you go. So ask and you shall receive abundance is in your way. Know that you can have all that. And so now that we put the three cards together, so in case you pick card number one, right? So maybe it's time for you to start, you know, concentrating on manifesting something that you want instead of just wishing let's have it know that you can have it or maybe you already started doing that which is if you already started doing that you're in the right track if you haven't started doing that time to do that that is if you pick car number one if you pick car number two positive affirmations meditations and you know what it's not just the affirmation but it's meditations uh, you know, lining up yourself to higher frequencies, doing, uh, putting some effort into your, you know, into your spiritual path. It's also uh, elevating your frequencies. So in this case, if you pick card number two, if you're already doing your affirmations, if you're already working on that, you are in the right, you're doing the good thing. You're, you're in the right, in the right place. If you're not doing any of that, if you pick this one means, Go ahead, start working on yourself. Start creating some affirmations that will work with you and elevate that frequency, okay? Card number three, abundance. You probably, if you pick card number three and you're already doing these things, you're already probably starting to see the abundance coming your way. Now, if you, if you get card number three and you're not doing any of this, you probably feel like you're lacking, but in this case, it's telling you that when you do all this, when you set your mind to manifest and do your affirmation, your positive affirmation, you definitely going to start seeing abundance and whatever is what you want to attract to yourself. And that is your car read. I hope you enjoyed this. Now, let's stay tuned because we're going to uh, tune you now to your chakras. Okay, let's balance our chakras. In this, we're going to balance all our chakras. I'm going to be playing a tune, and each tune corresponds to each chakra. So when I say the root chakra, it will be right in your base, and this is the red. Picture the red spinning right on your root chakra then when i click on sacral you're going to picture orange color on your sacral when we go to the solar plexus i'm going to play the solar plexus tune P picture solar plexus which is right in your belly picture the sun the yellow color then i'm going to go into the heart tune which will be the green color you're going to feel that twirling that color then I'm going to go to the throat chakra, the tune, and then you're going to picture the blue color. And if you cannot picture, you can always look at here. I'm going to be pointing at the one that we're working on. That way you don't get lost. Okay, and that's in your throat chakra. Then I'm going to play the third eye, and the third eye is purple, and it's right there. You're going to feel that. It's spinning on your third eye. Then I'm going to play this... Um, crown chakra which I'm using this color for the crown chakra you can all also use white like I have it here white in that one here or it could be that color okay let's do this so everybody take a deep breath in you don't have to close your eyes because if you want to see the colors but if you are a person that can see colors that's fine when your eyes close but you don't have to close your eyes just take in this energy and we're going to start with the root chakra which is the red right on your base so now just 
feel that spinning red color opening your red chakra your root chakra to feel protected to feel secure manifest bring abundance into your life Now we're moving to the sacral chakra, which is the orange. So picture that orange color twirling and twirling right on your sacral. And that to become creative. Bring creativity into your life. Ideas. Direction. Then we're going to move to your solar plexus, which is your belly. It will be the yellow color. So picture the sun shining on your belly. And keep relaxed and keep taking in this energy. And this is your power. This is where the sun shines. And you take your power back where you take control of your life. Then we're moving into your heart. That's the green color. Picture the green color twirling right into your heart. And this is the frequency for the heart. Hold, put your hand in your heart and feel your heart. Feel self-love. Love for the universe, love for everything that exists in this planet and the whole entire universe. When we have love, unconditional love, we can actually connect to the whole universe and manifest anything we want. Now let's move to your throat chakra. Right on your throat, picture the blue twirling and twirling for you to be able to express yourself and speak your truth and express yourself and also communicate with the whole universe. In turn, you can manifest too. Let's move into your third eye, which is the purple. I don't know if you can see purple here, but... <laughs> And again, picture that purple turning on your third eye. If you want to tap with your, one of your fingers, your third eye while we're doing this, it also works beautifully. This is for your intuition, for you to be able to follow your intuition and listen to it and understand it. Let's move to the crown chakra. Divine connection. It's a white light coming right from your crown chakra and being able to connect to all the divine powers to your higher self. And your chakras are all balanced. Take a deep breath in, guys. Take a deep breath in. And go ahead, feel free to comment away. How did you feel with this? How do you feel? Do you feel more in control? Do you feel better? Do you feel relaxed? Would you like me to continue doing things like that? And go ahead and comment away. I love you guys.